It was all rather like a sumo social experiment. To see if Ukrainian Shishi, given enough booming support, could be inspired to take the third division title, something he'd rarely looked like doing. With his birthland under fire, he gained immense sympathy, loud claps from nearly all present to make a half full arena seem brimming. <laughs> And as his wrestling has also improved, fine results beckoned. We missed his first win over Yutaka Shaw, joining the action instead in match two against Kainoshima. which was over in a flash. His foe perhaps surprised at how upright he was. No more crouching like a freestyle wrestler. Match three looked to be tougher. But it didn't seem so by much, as Shishi sped in head first, took the outside left and scooped from the right to overwhelm the university star. At 3-0, we thought, golly, we might actually carry him all the way. Next up was Tsukahara, who Shishi had beaten in his first official bout outside of Tokyo. <laughs> Omens looked good. But omens alone don't win matches. This was one time when perhaps a lower charge was demanded. Shishi's head caught above Tsukahara's in the clash, the Japanese hitting up to follow through in one glorious motion as the Ukrainian's left hand skidded off the shoulder. But even in defeat came resounding applause, rousing him strongly for week two. While his past self may have gone down here like a baby chasing an escaped balloon, this Shishi watched and waited, his left leg the constant axis. Devotion to form was apparent here, too. <laughs> With even a parry thrown in, how orthodox his sumos become. 
Temptation to pull was resisted, while legs pedaled forwards with real rhythm. And in the finale, he seemed more bothered by the extra pre-match rituals, re-encountered after several months. Hadoka, no pushover, was merely brushed aside, gripped tightly with the right and sent down to the clay with left foot opening out well. 6 and 1 marked Shishi's joint best score at this level, and this time against stronger opposition. He's not so at home with interviews yet, declining all offers in March, but with feelings as clearly expressed as this, who needs embellishment? This was a genuinely priceless sumo experience. A wrestler, not from these shores, completely uniting the crowd and riding that wave of goodwill to success. It was wonderful to watch, let alone achieve. Shishi, great job, and thank you.